What can West Virginians do to get this public option passed? I mean, what can you know, we do? The best thing for West Virginians to do to support the public option, um, which is necessary to as a counterweight because it's nonprofit, doesn't have to make any money, a counterweight to the insurance companies, um, is to write letters to the editor of their local newspaper. Because we're already receiving, you know, 5,000 letters a day or phone calls a week or whatever it is. And, um, and we can't even be in our offices that much these days. So write a local newspaper because that puts it throughout the community. Write a letter to the editor. Don't write a, an editorial or an op-ed piece. People won't read it. Write a letter to the editor. People will read that and because they like you, they'll say, ah, now I know what I want to feel. Are you getting more calls and support or for the public option nowadays? Or? Uh, I, I, you know, I never asked for that. I never asked for that uh, because I, I, I know it's the right thing to do. And um, controversy sometimes doesn't give you, sometimes people just organize to give certain answers. And, and um, they're, they're organized, you know, almost robo-type type things. Uh, so on, on, on something like that, I know how, I know West Virginians, I think I know what will be helpful to them. I hope I'm right on it, and so I fight for that.